Things I change. Swear. Things change very fast in battle rap. And Woo! before we get to the announcement of the Ultimate Madness swap, um, let's break down the timeline of this, right? Um, first and foremost, when J Black and Smack were doing the random and Henny Man were doing the random selections for Ultimate Madness, they originally drew Swave versus Prep, right? And they said, mm-hmm. "Hold on, we have this match already booked a week before the tournament. We can't, we can't just." put them to battle again as a rematch. So maybe it should have been smart as I had just moved it up to begin with. So they go, no, 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 just swap it with the last match. So you had Twerk versus Prep and Casey versus Swave. Then the next day, somebody gave a call, very upset about the swap. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? And I was on Clubhouse, and one of the battle rappers that is in the tournament was not was not happy about the selection. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure you guys can make a guess. And um, some calls were made. Switches were made. And now here we have it, man. Ultimate Madness swap. It is official. Prep and Soave Severs match that was booked on the 18th is moved up to Ultimate Madness 3. And now Twerk and KCJ will be battling in the first round. I hope y'all didn't make y'all bracket yet before that announcement. Swave 30. <laughs> Hurricane Dew says, wow. Jolisa says, I like this better. Harko Flavor says, can we not guess who would do something like that? A hey, hey, hardcore flavor. I, I try not to report on Clubhouse too much because although it's a public place and it's all fair game, I feel like it's still a private conversation. So if you're there, you're there. If you're not, you missed it. That's how I see it. But um, I throw it to you guys first. Um, Casey J versus New Jersey Torque, Sway versus Prep. What do you guys think of these matches before I give you guys the numbers? All right. Poor Casey says Jazzberry CC. <laughs> uh, Hurricane Dude says there's politics in the tourney. There's politics in everywhere. Politics everywhere. Casey 2 1. Tata says this is a dog fight. Hardcore Flavor says Twerk 30. Thank you for the props. Anastasio says Jersey. Dude says I can't call that battle. Mm. Problem says Twerk 2 1. So Lisa says Casey and Twerk's going to be a goodie. Either of them it says do. Achilles says Swave made a good path on the way to the finals. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. KCJ21. Uh Twerk's gonna choke. Casey's more prepared. Prep to one over Swave. Twerk to one. Twerk to one. Love Casey, but don't think she can topple him in this setting. Swave can talk to prep. All right, let me give you guys some numbers here. This is my favorite part of the job. This is my favorite part of battle rap, the numbers. Because I always feel like they kind of tell a story that we, we try to ignore. And battle rappers love to discredit polls after the battles, but they love to look at them before the battles for motivation. Mm. But I'll leave that alone. So KCJ was the sixth highest favorite when she was originally battling Swave Sever. She had a 64% lead in the, in the poll. Now, when she's battling Twerk, she is the third biggest underdog of the tournament with 16% to Twerk's 84%. Yikes. Swave 7 still remains an underdog, 30% to Preps, 70%. CC, when you, when you hear Casey go from the sixth highest favorite to the third biggest underdog, what runs through your mind? I'm not surprised. Um, I think... Everybody, I think it was the same way when it was Twerk versus Prep. More, more people were going to put their money on Twerk than Prep. So I'm definitely not surprised that, that people are keeping that same energy now that it's Casey versus uh, Twerk. Prep actually got ah. more. Prep got more votes than Casey. Not by a lot, but she he got more. Ah, uh, I'm gonna say this. Now, if they would have kept it the way they had it, I still would have been uh, a little worried for Casey in the second round because I would have probably had Twerk advancing. And then they would have probably had to face each other off. Am I, am I, make, okay. So they would have had to face each other off. So, but now she can Twerk the first round. Now my nerves is really bad. Hurricane Dew says, really bad. Hurricane Dew says, I thought Casey was supposed to be the Wody. She should be good. Hurricane Dude. I mean, it's Toxic Thursdays. Unleash so yourself. So this is the thing. This mm-hmm. is the thing, though, dude. I was saying this before we got on air. This is the thing that we argued. We never seen Casey have back to back, like 
stellar performances, right? You know what I'm saying? So I that's why I I I that's why I haven't been so quick to pick Casey to win all of all of it. Because I haven't seen Casey put back to back stellar performances. And I think if you're gonna get to the finals, especially for this tournament where there's a lot of heavy hitters in this month, <laughs> you're gonna have to be great. Not just one round and not get lucky the next round and be like, oh, I was kind of ass, but I got lucky. No, you're going to have to put in your best material weekend or round in, round out. I haven't seen that from KC. I mean, we saw her from Miss Mark, stellar performance, body of the year, arguably. She went to coffee and her material wasn't there. Then she got a swamp, eliminated that ass real quick. Then she went to Bonnie. And she was, mm. so again, and that's time in between these battles. She's only going to have a couple of weeks. So even if I, even if I got her advancing and being in twerk, I, I don't, I'm still, I'm, I'm I still, have, I don't know. This I, is tough. This I got, is tough I, I, I got, I got a, I got a, I got a prop far. bet that I want to propose to the chat. I'm going to ask you, Cece, all right? And I'm going to make this a real bet in the near future. Once we launch the LTBR Sportsbook for Ultimate Man and Street, be on the lookout for that. A lot of interesting things coming out. There's three women in the first round of the tournament, or three women in the tournament period, right? How many of them would advance? I'm going to set the line at one and a half. Do you think over one and a half of the women will advance or under? Ooh. Juan says over. Achilles says under. Problem says over. Tata says over. Official will advance. Under. Over. Under. Under. It's a lot of different matches here. I like that number right there. How yeah, does, how does, yeah. How does ha no, it, it's not about half. So so let me let me break this down to you, right? You can't put numbers with over unders directly like like just a number because you need to have the half to separate it, right? One and a half means, all right, if one of the three women advanced, it went under. If two or three of the women advanced, it went over. So do you think two or three of them can advance or only one of them would advance? That's pretty much what I'm asking you. You think two of them can advance, CC going over? Or you got you got that under? What? I want to see all the ladies go far. Um, But I'm going a, I'm to a predict, I, I, I want to say that one of them is going to get to the finals. So I guess that's under. Maybe official. I want. Yoshi can write fast though. Yoshi can get ready in a short amount of time. I, I I believe in Yoshi too. We've seen Yoshi get ready with like, hey, get the call. You got a couple of weeks, but this is who you about to battle. We about to announce it, and she's ready when it comes time to battle. Yoshi's a fast writer. And yeah. she's getting better and better. That was all. That's another thing me and Do and all the ladies on the panel was saying about Yoshi was she has gotten better. And this is, our, you know, this is our first time seeing Yoshi this year. So, yeah, I mean, I, I just you know? also like I also like that she's kind of unpredictable. Like drugs is probably just gonna try to powerhouse his way to a victory, while Yoshi's gonna probably defuse him doing a whole bunch of other stuff and like. She has the fan vote to her favor because drugs is just not a fan favorite. Um, I'm pretty sure they're going to bring another lady on this panel. They can't do it last time and not do it again. You know what I'm saying? They put ladies in the tournament. They got to put a lady on the panel. I think it has to happen. You know what I'm saying? So. And I think it has to be someone who is um, neutral. I, I, I don't want to see a woman that has gone back and forth with anybody that's in this. And the same with the men. I don't think it should be anybody that has been going back and forth with anybody that's participating if, in this what tournament. If, what if Remy Neutral or Papoose? People. What if Remy or Papoose were judges? How would you feel about that? I like Remy. I, I thought Remy did a good job recapping her and Papoose. I thought they were really cool. Um, Dude says, no, please. Kings versus Queens. No, I thought you. they were cool. The problem says, nah. Now, Remy going to keep it a bug if she thinks his ass is ass. Um, I do think you need that one outside voice too. So if it's not Remy or Pap, I still wouldn't mind there being somebody from the industry because we can't always just 
uh, hone in our view to everybody within the culture. We need to open it to somebody that's not in the culture, somebody that probably doesn't fully okay. know everything to see how would they grasp everything because that that matters too. Lloyd Banks, Lloyd Banks would be a great selection. I would love Lloyd Banks I as well. Love Lloyd Banks because he's always tapped in. He always been tapped in. It's not just URL for just bad rap period. I always see him talking about uh, bad rap. Shout out to him and uh, Cal having a little convo on Twitter. Yeah, Mickey Fast. Um, I think everybody wants Mickey Fax as a judge, and it sounds good on paper till it actually happens. I that's why I'm I, that's why I'm scared because Mickey, I the problem you beat me to it. I think a lot of people think Mickey is biased with certain people, especially like Cortez. I can see a lot of people bringing that shit up if Mickey was announced. Him and Cortez are like for real, for real cool. And also, there's been a lot of times we have heard Mickey say, oh, I heard this person's material is fire. It's going to be a problem for whoever is battling them. And then when we see it, it's like, Mickey, what were you, what? So I don't know. But again, Mickey's cool. I don't know. I don't know. All right, well, let's let's keep the ball rolling because we're going to bring all, all the call-ins at 11 o'clock. We got a couple more things on the on the I new slate here. Bro. I say Tony Bro too. Shout out to Black Me uh Black Compass Media. Yeah, Tony Bro. Or has, do. Tony Let Bro definitely do it. I'm not doing it. Tony Let Bro do definitely time. has to make uh, a reappearance again. I would love to see him again for the third time. Let also, me. last night on primetime, CC, as you were familiar previously on LTBR Daily, on Tuesday, A Ward has some very, very spicy words for Geechee Gotti. Very, oh, yeah, very, 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 very spicy words. And Geechee Gotti got a hold of them. And he was not so happy to hear them. In fact, he has a response to A-Ward. End quote. Geechee says, A-Ward is trash. He got a little win over me, and he thinks he could talk about me going 7-7. Seven and seven. He ain't even qualified to talk about my career, and I'm going to have to spend the block on him. Well, he been wanting to spend the block on A-Ward. He trying to get revenge. You know, Geechee doesn't even have Twitter, so, like, I don't even know how this got to him. You know what I'm saying? What happened? He heard he heard A-Ward's words, and he was no, offended. No, but what happened? Did he get kicked off, or he just in Twitter jail? Oh, you know, somebody reported him. You know what I'm saying? Maybe his opponent. Who reported Geechee's a bitch? And, it, and you know what? And that's funny how that happened right after him and Mass were going back and forth. So what? whoever in Hoffa gang was reporting Geechee's tweets, use a bitch for that. Stay out of grown folk business. Stay out of... Let them two men... I don't understand why fans interject and do stuff like that. Let these people have they have let these people go back and forth. Keep your ass out of it. This ain't got nothing to do with you. Let's read the chat. Freetown Maker says A Ward's overrated as hell with all due respect. Wow, he chose violence today. What's wrong with you? Very mm -hmm. petty. Geechee played with A Ward. He shouldn't. <laughs> Math reported him. Hoffa gang is hella butthurt. Says Swole. Damn. Shouldn't have read that one. A-Ward compare, is comparing a debatable with Cassidy to Geechee's debatables is crazy. Lowe says they're groupies. M4 says Geechee bullied Math. See, now this, now this became about Math. This, this, this got to Geechee and Math sooner than I wanted it to get to. Um, <laughs> Hold on. Four times like, the culture needs this rematch. Shaolin says big pause. I want to say that Hip hop is real or 15 minutes of fame. One of them caught both of them at the same place. And it was it was nothing but love between them. But Geechee joked that he wants his revenge with A Ward because he ain't the same Geechee that A Ward beat years ago. And we all know this because again, there was a time when people were talking about Geechee was battling with his eyes closed. Now Geechee looking you dead in your eyes and talking to your mofo. So okay. That, this ain't the same Kichi. But this ain't the same A-Ward, neither. Oh! <laughs> Rebuttal game. <okay. laughs> Can you believe that battle's about to be three years old already? Damn, time flies. Yo, I'm telling you nothing. Bro, time flies in battle rap. Things change a lot in battle rap. Constantly. I can't believe their battle's almost three years old already. That is so crazy. Um, they said A Ward battled a different Geechee. A Ward would smoke him, says problem. Um, 
11 a.m. We're going to bring people on. Yep, 11 a.m. So we got another 10 minutes here before we bring people on. Get your A-word, though, man. I, I'm i here for that rematch. You know what I'm saying? I'm here for that rematch. I'm here for it for sure. But um, it says Geechee 2 1 in a classic. Just wondering. Uh, I just came here to say Rum Nitty for the UM tournament, says Lamar. All right, Lamar. I've seen, I've, I've seen a lot of upsets in the world. But I, I will say this. I, I, upset. That's I, why I need to know who the judges are. Tata and me are still going to wait until we make our bracket because we need to know who's going to be judging. I, I just need to know this. Yeah. Sh- shout out to Lo, LTBR West, our guy in the building. He made his bracket the second it was available. I was like, whoa, hold on. KCJ and, and Sway have been prepping. There's, new, there's two new matches. Everybody's been jumbled. We don't know the judges. How, what are you doing? Wait, hold on. <laughs> he said, oh, I got this. <laughs> there's a, there's a lot of decisions still to be that. made. I, I haven't even made the tier list yet for this. Like, Oh, hardcore flavor. I love that question. And I would say the riot. Because you already know, I don't see a word, a word. Um, going to URL anytime soon, so that's why I have I am not asking that question no more to him because it is what it is. But I definitely would want that on the riot. I think yes, I know I can hear people say, "Oh, it's gonna be so much gas in there." I don't care. It's gonna be what? It's gonna be what? It's gonna be what? Gonna be so much gas. The only gonna do is gas, Gucci. <laughs> All right, let's close off with this last bit of news, and then we're going to get two Super Fight predictions. So, Rosenberg Raw responds to Swamp, and he calls out Swamp, and quote, it says, tell your daddy Smack and your Uncle Beasley to set it up. <laughs> Rosenberg's last four battles on the league has been T-Rex, Head Ice. Um, am I right there? T-Rex, Head Ice. And show off? I feel like I'm missing the battle there. And, and Snake Eyes. Uh, of course. Yeah, snake. Who, who can remember a Snake Eyes battle? Anywho, uh, Snake Eyes, T-Rex, uh, show off, and Head Ice. I didn't say it, y'all. Um, I'm wondering, you know, he might be 4-0 and there. Some people say he might not even lost a round, right? They think he'd be T-Rex every round. They think he'd be Ice every round. And he'd be show off every round. He might have beat Snake every round. Maybe Snake got one. I don't know. I can't remember it. I don't remember, remember his battles too well. But um, Rosenberg has become underrated, CC. And Rosenberg versus Swamp, I'm, I, I'm not going to say no. I'm not saying no. And shout out to Rosenberg because, again, he had another loud mouth battler talking all that shit. Was just so loud, but was so wrong. Because what did Rosenberg do? He gone in the battle, and he beat they ass. And that's what you're supposed to do. So shout out to Rosenberg. And I think at this point, if he wants Swamp, set that up. However, I don't see this happening on RBE. Because you know about them contracts and the blocking. So, again, smack. Beasley and I'm, you know what? Let's get Rosenberg back on URL. Can, can, can we can we push back on the blocking? We don't know about the blocking, all right? We just know people have contract obligations and they cannot battle a lot of places, or they don't battle a lot of places. Maybe because of loyalty too. I don't know about battles getting blocked. Everybody says that. I don't believe that. I don't buy that. Battle rappers love to say that when the reality is they're getting two offers from two different places and they're trying to haggle and negotiate. Their... Don't let these battle rappers lie to you all the time. Their battles are not getting blocked. People's League like, owners, too. People's like, oh, well, people are under contract. Look at Riggs. Riggs and A-Ward battled, and Riggs is an ultimate madness. Is he, He's not getting blocked, is he? Well, that's on um, what league he battled on? He battled on Wartown. Uh-huh. Which we know what league we're, we know what league we're talking about. I hear you, man. I hear you, but I'm not. I'm not. I'm not buying it. I'm not buying it to be honest with you. Truthfully, he, he, yeah, he. he, he this, all, this all started because Howard Don put out a contract <laughs> of fifty-two thousand dollars, and he's like, "My contract paid me to not go there." Your contract never said that, you lean head. Like it, it, it was never in your contract, you freak. 
So you created this whole storyline, and you know everybody's gonna run with it. Like, come on, be more responsible with with what you do out here. All right, Rosenberg and Swamp. I I, I do. There you go. Yes, I like him. I, I I like the match. I like the match a lot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, KRS two jumped out the window and had to walk it back. Yes, he did. I'm staying out of that. That ain't none of my business. Hey, you the one that brought it up. It was your business five minutes ago. <laughs> I made an assessment. All right. Let's, let's, it's I not, made an assessment. BX Legend said it best. It's not happening. Let's be real. Yes. And put on paper. I think it's important for us to make sure we 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 breathe life to the correct narratives and we dead the wrong ones. Right? Uh, we Again. Again. Yeah. There has been a league owner that said certain things as well so again you gonna believe murder mook i'm not murder talking mook? about mook. murder mook was also the other one who was like oh they're paying dude i'm not talking about murder mook you know who i'm talking about uh, all right you know who i'm talking about i don't know who you're talking about all right man let's get this uh <laughs> who's on the who's on the queue cc who, who's who we calling first uh if y'all want to pull up just uh dm me on twitter at CC on air and at CECE on air, and I will send you the link. And we're doing super fight predictions. So, All right, who's first up? I'm ready. Well, okay, I'll send it to you. I think I know who, you, what your name is, Anastasio. Anastasio. All right, it should be good. Anastasia. Anastasia. There you go. <laughs> All right, we got four time up next afterwards. Okay, and then uh, with Salu, I see you too. I'm going to get you up there too after four time. JC about to cook. Shoot me the link. Okay, you next. Right. Johnson and Johnson joint. <laughs> Anastasio's in the building. Let's get the clock ready and let's get the clock set up. Oh shit, my man got the shape up. What's going on here? Oh. Nah, my sh I'm looking crazy right oh, now. Okay, I it, it look it looked nice from that angle. Never mind. I take it back. Well, let me let me stay at this angle then. I'm <laughs> 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 ass dog. All right, Anastasia, you're not new to this. You're true to this. You already know the vibe. It's Toxic Thursdays. No need to get political. No need to get analytical. <laughs> Just speak your peace and speak your heart. Let's start the clock. We got the super fight predictions going. You can start with whatever match you want. Uh, bottom of the card, JC and Nana, right? Yes, sir. JC 30, clearly. All right. It's not. It's going to be a gentleman's 30. Gentleman. Right. Nothing, nothing crazy. Just, you know, it's going to be levels. That's what the, 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 chat, the chat saying, shut that damn the dog. dog. No. And look at Yoshi G with her check marks. Shout out to Yoshi. She's finally verified. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yoshi with the check. Um what, what we got next? Uh Big T and, and Bill Collector. That's gonna be a classic. I think I still think Bill gonna take it. In the close in that two one edge. Mm. Okay. It's gonna be a two one. Edge. Well, this is this is Big T's caffeine debut. Is there any special right. sauce to that? You know, he's medium tea now, <laughs> a little more healthy. He's when the breath is changing, like. What the fuck up? Um. <laughs> yeah, the, you getting thirty by he's getting thirty by his dog, y'all. <laughs> See, that's the thing about dogs. Dogs will let you know who really runs the house. <laughs> I got my niece and nephew there. He think it's play day. Come here. But um, that's why it's going to be a 2 one edge. Like, in my opinion, Big T could have beat Rum Nitty, but he lost all – like, when he was bigger, but he lost that energy, so he couldn't keep performing in the in the, in the the second and third like that first was because I had him beaten Nitty in the first. So that's what I'm saying. It's going to be a 2-1 two one, two one edge, but I think Bill going to pull it out, especially with that we loved you better as a fat nigga uh, scheme. Um, then we got Shug. Shug got and Shug versus... Danny Myers. Let's talk about that one. Jersey. 
jersey. Nope. Ta ta ta. I am a big Danny Myers fan. It's gonna be a close battle. That's all I'm gonna say. But I'm just gonna say I Jersey bias here. You know, we just ain't gonna we we gonna run always run with the home team. That's true. That's how we rock. That's it. fair. That's fair, CC. You gotta ride with the state. Jersey. But we love Danny. I'm not gonna be mad if Danny wins. Some people, you know, every time Danny wins, some people wanna shoot their brains out. They just gotta put some respect on Danny's name. Um, half a two one. Wait, did I, hear, wait did I hear correctly? Did I hear that correctly? Clear. Clear? Why are you saying yes, that? You got to put some context to this one. Oh, shit. The chat is writing. That, he said, that's a hot take. Get him out of here. He don't know who he's talking about. He got rabies. They say, you got rabies. <laughs> well, yeah. we, need to, we need to hear this. Math clear. Let's let's hear it. Let's hear it. Make yeah, math clear. Make the case. Personally, like, I think math, everybody be sleeping on math pen. His pen is not trash. Mav has done this at the highest level for years on, and personally, that you's a bitch. Well, you can't say that to Hoffa. Hoffa's one of the few people on record who will run down on you and fuck your shit up. So it's got him. So it's really gonna be like real t that real talk shit. They both have a run of that. I think that's gonna negate. And so it was like, who gonna have better bars throughout the rest of the round? I think Hoff is a little bit of a better rapper than uh, Geechee, in my opinion. Hmm. The chat is you saying, see what he did to Hollow? The chat is saying the cocaine Hollow is a hell of a goat. drug. <laughs> cocaine is a hell of a drug. Somebody it said is. he got slapped by Aladdin. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done! <laughs> well, you know what? That is a, that's a toxic hot take because, you know, he's a 12% underdog. So you're riding, you're riding with that 12%. Obviously. And then, like, I ain't gonna lie. Hoffa made a, a valid point. Geechee really don't got no body, so it's gonna be close. Like, it's gonna be a but, close battle. But in the So don't let Hoffa have another and... Millie Rock moment, and he could take the whole thing. So, in the same token, though, <clears throat> Geechee is going to probably say, okay, but you've been bodied the worst out of many people, and you body people but it's nothing that like I don't really hear people talk about Matt Hoffa's bodies like I hear people talk about other people's bodies how many bodies Geechee really got though that's that's always been the thing about Geechee and don't get me wrong I love he Geechee got so I mean math is not lying <clears throat> so it's just like okay yeah math talk about, about hip you know, he was out there on some bullshit. You, when you see Math get body, you could tell Math was on some bullshit. Like, you could literally see it in his demeanor when he rapping. He like, all right, I'm here. I'm here to get my check, and then I'm out. Well, that's Whatever. why he you, can't you, be you saying can see what he said in the face. I'll talk about. But when oh, you see Math take y'all, y'all don't have the heart. Y'all don't care. Y'all don't take this. Yeah, but when, like, Matt, you... Right, right. but when you see Math, all right, all right. But when you see Math take it seriously, we, 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 he go out there and, and get crazy. The clock has ended, Anastasia. Uh, the, chat, the chat is frustrated. Um, I, think I think you did your I still job. Love the chat. I think you did your job. I still love the chat. You did. You did your job. You've gotten them riled up, and you got your hot take off. We appreciate you as always, brother. Um, shout out to Miss Marla for the follow. Y'all could, you know, I'll be in the chat talking my shit anyway. So, they said, go back to your dog. You little badass. <laughs> Look at this badass demon. Lamar, he definitely bodied hollow. I have to that's, a nice, that's a nice dog there, man. That's, that's, that's Thank a you. There, man. It's all a right. pit. Right. Yeah, he a pit mixed with a laugh. So he all black. Aww. All right, all right, all right. All right. We get, you see, now, now, the chat's, now the chat's happy again. All right? I like this. I like this. <laughs> all right, bro. No, they yeah. like the dog. They uh, don't right. like you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, y'all. See, see who's next up, man. Uh, four time is next up. I'm gonna get him on here now. Where are you at four time? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at though? Where you at? What's his Twitter name? Um D Gooden, I believe. Gooden. Here we go. <clears throat> I always forget four time because again, you 
four times on caffeine, but you totally something different on Twitter. Yeah, it's okay. So I just sent That's you the link. Right. You know what I'm saying? We got two different. No, I'm just days. saying. I'm just because, like, for me, like for my for what I do, they Real always brain. tell us to always have your like everything should be the same. If you're a CC on air on IG, it's supposed to be like that on Twitter, YouTube. Whatever it is, that's what it's supposed to be. Reggie says, after school ends this semester, I'll be here every Thursday. All right. I like that. You better be doing your homework and studying and getting good grades, too. All right, All right Mom. Damn. Reggie's... I want to see your transcript. I want to see what you got for this semester. Re Reggie's, Reggie's have... too busy going to these Q-Dog parties every Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, all right? <laughs> Drinking punch out of a goddamn tub, all right? Well... <laughs> <laughs> Those were the days. That, yo, I don't. I miss college for the social parts. Like okay. I miss the parties, the get-togethers, the, the summers where everybody be like, "Yo, we ain't going home to mom and dad. We all gonna stay up here for the summer, and we are going to turn the fuck up." Now, Ooh, parties. Now, we now, 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 if we turn up like that, we're in a coma. Yes, uh, and I'm hurting. Let's, let's bring in four time. My stomach hurts. My body hurts. Everything. My back, my neck. <laughs> How do you morning, drink whiskey and your back hurts the next day? Like, that's some bullshit. Like, why does my back hurt? All right, man. I got four time in the building. Yeah, uh -oh. two Classy as always. It's crazy because this guy's so well professionally dressed, but every <laughs> Thursday comes here with the shits. He said, My man's is ready for an interview. <laughs> Nah, my, my man's, yeah, my man's, ready like to break down these my man's ready to break down these battles. Uh, Full Time, aka D Gooden. You're not new to this, you're true to this. But start your clock, super fight predictions. You can go wherever you want to go. It's on you. Uh, <laughs> go Bill Collector 2 1 over Big T. I ain't seen Big T in a while. Um, yeah, that's a good point. But we haven't seen Bill Collector in a while, too. Yeah, but Bill always shows up, you know, especially for the caffeine. He really hasn't been slacking for a while, so. And um, <laughs> to perform, so you're gonna get a chance to perform, show up. I have I I don't know what to expect from Big T since he lost weight. So let, let's let's just go with the consistent Bill Collector. And a, a Big T surprise me. Big T surprise me. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Who, who else? Um, who else on this card? Let's go, Geechee, 2-1. Two, 2-1, one. Two, one, clear over math. Oh, straight into Math going to show up. Math a professional. He, he'll he show up for this one. You know, he won't slide for this one. I at least give him a round just because he a vet. You know, he may choke one round, win one round, and just lose one round clear. See, I, I like that answer because it's not, I don't think he's just going to roll over and die. Like, Yeah, it ain't it ain't no corral, but he's still going to say relax probably like in his first 10 bars. So... <laughs> Um, yeah, Geechee's showing up, man. He's going for champion of the year. I don't think he's going to win it, though. I got Danny winning, winning it this year. So it's just them two and probably Loso for the for the champion of the year running for the top three. Okay, um, okay. Who, who else on the card? Well, speaking of Danny, uh, Danny Mize and Shotgun Shug. Uh, Danny, Danny 3 0. You know? <gasps> so you Danny, think Danny Danny's is going to continue his streak of not losing a single round on caffeine? He won't lose to Shotgun Shug. It, 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 shotgun, shotgun, sugar ain't the one who's gonna be doing it. Wow. We gonna, we probably gonna get a shook pocket tap because Danny, Danny, just because Shug don't tap pocket tap anyone big, so we probably get a shook pocket tap. But Danny going three on. Danny been when was the last Danny battle? Probably last week, right? He always battling at somebody, right? <laughs> So Danny three zero. Well, man. the last Danny. time we seen him on Cafe was against Kid Chaos, and he looked fantastic. I never seen that battle. They still haven't dropped it. I missed that battle. Oh man, you're you're in for you're in for a goodie. You're in for yeah, a goodie. Yeah, I, I was at work that day. And I, I I I missed it. So I've been waiting for them to drop it for like the last month so I could watch it. But I think they're going to drop it this week on Sunday and just do the reload. Yeah. So yeah, I get a yeah. chance to watch that one. But um, but as far as I heard, Danny three zero Kid Chaos. If I'm not mistaken, right? So. If he, he did it at the K -K -K yeah, he won every round on the fan vote. I don't agree with the score, but the fan votes has spoken. I, I, I got to respect. All right, so he won clear, basically. He, respect the vote. Yeah, so he gonna he gonna clearly be Shug. Shug did good against B Dot. That's probably the best Shug I've seen in about two years. <laughs> Do again, he can. And what was the last battle? 
Last battle is JC and Nun Nun. <laughs> the battle we don't need or like. Oh. Damn! Oh, oh man. Let's let's go let's go JC let's go JC three. Oh, you don't even have to promo for this one. He can just show up and um. If none of them went around, man, I I I may take my first drink ever, man. To tell you the truth, I I don't see how this matchup got made. But JC need a paycheck. None of them sitting there. Why not? You know you gotta you gotta keep the you gotta keep the. Now, hold on, hold on. There's too much none disrespect, all right? Hold on. JC need a warm up. You know, that, JC got to keep a warm up. We were all excited. Time. Now we don't like this match. I don't get it. It's not that none none's bad, but JC just body flames. He's been on the run. You just look at the name. You just want to say JC automatically. I'm not saying none none's bad. He, he he's good, but is he in JC level? I feel you. No, I feel right? like what JC is doing, he deserves bigger plates. I feel you on them. Yeah, but JC done been bad. He, I don't know what's left for JC. You know, after a while, all the big names are already gone. You know, everybody you know? says so they want bigger plates for them, but you can't want you can't want something for somebody that they don't want for themselves. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm like, not, I'm, he, not conf- he, I'm not if, saying that. Like, you're worth what you accept. So if he constantly accepts these battles, maybe he's happy and okay with being uh... this guy in the league. It's you guys that are not happy and okay with it. You guys are asking him to be more than what he should be and what he's okay with being. What? I, I'm not asking anything. I, I just want JC to show up, man. I don't care who he battles. As long as he show up. If you get a name, you get a name. If you don't get a name... He don't get a name. He don't book himself, so you know. So like you, like Fran said, he get offered none, none. He take none, and he get offered rigs. He get rigs. He offered prep. He take prep. If he don't want to battle, he, he don't says battle, yes. Right? We can't be the ones upset, right? He's the one saying yes. Yeah. So um, they always say yeah. he needs if a he manager. Don't want, I mean, he has NHB Mills. His man's his man's probably writes off on it too. Like you know, I'm starting. I'm not gonna keep getting upset every time I hear. And I respect JC. He's a mm-hmm. fucking warrior. He battles seven times a year and almost always wins. It's very yeah. few. Times I mean, he'd have been perfect for the tournament based on the tier that's in the tournament. If JC was in the tournament, we would be picking him to win it. No, he would have been. A, he would have probably been like. A, he would have probably been one of the favorites. You're right, you're right. But he definitely would have been a favorite. Yeah. I mean, it's Wave 7 in the tournament, so come on. Oh, boy. All right, that's that. your clock is done. Yeah. <laughs> your, My clock your, is done? Your clock is done, uh, man. Your clock is done on that one. Yeah. Uh, nah. I, I, would, I, I ain't going to lie to you. I had Casey win until she, she got swamped with, with um. Got Brad. Swamped with, with Brad. Yeah, she she, she she went from the from the fire to the frying pan, so. Brad. Yeah, they did a dirty. The chat says, can you breathe with your tie being that tight? Nah, it's loose. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to say it's loose. Yeah, yeah I, I'm, I'm surprised. I'm like, what are you guys talking about? I just have to read it because it's fun. Oh, yeah. it's, it's fun. Nah, forget the chat, man. The chat always going to get on me anyway. <laughs> so it, ain't, it ain't no big deal. I could take it, man. I'm from full, Brooklyn, so. Full time, man. My brother, man. You you a day one. You always tune in. You tapped in every single download, every single minute of listening time. We appreciate you as always, bro. Yeah. Yo, I'm still waiting for my hoodie, man. Tell Word? Dylan to get at me. Yeah, I got you. Like I'm, I'm going to have now. Dylan hit you up, bro. Yeah. Yeah, have a you. good day. Chat, stay safe out there. Say less. All right, brother. All right, cool. Um, mm. I read a chat message where it was like, um, JC's overrated because we want him to battle, like, in the sense of Lux. I don't want to misquote it, so I don't want to fully, like, if you could, if you could write, if you could type that message again, I would love for you to say it again because I don't want to misquote you. But again, like this guy has been a top twenty battle rapper for the last four years. Like he's one of the twenty best guys in the globe for the last four years. He wins almost all the time. Did you he have showed him in the top twenty. He's been top 20 since, 20 since 2017, since 2018, since 2019, and 2020. All right, like he is consistently good. Maybe he's not your great. Maybe he's not a superstar. Maybe he's not your summer man as headliner. But everybody doesn't have to be that. You know what I'm saying? Like, we can appreciate what he is, bro. 
It's like you're trying to ask no. Jimmy. You're asking Jimmy Butler to be LeBron. Like, why can't you just appreciate Jimmy Butler for who Jimmy Butler is? Like, he's never gonna be LeBron. He's never gonna be a top five player in the league. We can appreciate him for what he is, though. Yeah, battling these plates that are, you know, I, I'm done. It's not about me today. I'm done. It's not about me. Well, Salah, I sent you the link. So Jimmy up. Butler is a team player, and so is JC. JC lets you around know you need me. I got you. He is definitely a team player as well. But they're going to disqualify for champion. Yeah, who cares? JC doesn't care about winning that. You'd be, you'd be really surprised. He does not care about winning that. But he's always in the, he's always in the list. You can never make a best battle rapper list out and never and never include him. So I'm just I'm just getting tired of it. So I yeah, so JC, you're just going to have to battle battle mid-tiers for the rest of your life. Because no, because but obviously top tiers don't. They feel like they can get away every, without having to battle you. How, how, how about this? How about it this? Is what it is. Throw me, throw me a couple top tier names. He's battled almost all of them. He's battled almost all of them. The only piece, all people hasn't battled is Verb Surfing Lux. Oh, okay. oh we got Wasalo in the building. Hey, what's up? Yes, J- JC's, oh, no. JC's battle with Arsenal, Iron Solomon, K Shine, DNA, Av, like the Daylight. B dot, yeah, Danny Myers, Gichi Gotti, New Jersey Twerk, like Shock and Shug, Saga, Loso. Uh that's... those aren't even top tier names, but like what do you want? He's battled almost every top tier. B magic. I guess I I guess when they say bigger place, I guess they mean Lux, but Lux is not Lux is kind of Well it, almost Lux has battled seven people in, in nine years. No, no, but, but that's what I'm about <laughs> to say. Like Lux already written him off. Or, like, so I don't think he's like, ever gonna battle. So it wouldn't make sense. But almost nobody's maybe, gonna uh, battle Lux. But I guess I guess that's one way to look at it. Like JC's already battled everybody. But another side to look at it is like maybe we would rather see JC battle like a real sick or or Jay the Nightwing or easy like the new era. But also this card. These cars, if you guys notice, the super fights are kind of like appetizers. Like Smack is just like here, take this for uh, for and it kind of like is to hold us over for the next two weeks. If that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. I mean, look, he, he hangs on tight, and like I said, the three names he wants to battle: Lux, who was a fucking fairy, right? This guy battled seven times in nine years. Almost nobody could get a Lux battle. Verb and Surf, two people that retired and that are terrible right now as battle rappers. Yeah, I really want that battle. Yeah, I want that battle to see. It. Those guys know JC will kill him right now. That's why they're not gonna battle JC. Are you kidding me? Miss Hustle beat Verb. You think JC can't beat Verb? I I agree with Sue Surf and A Verb, but as as uh as an intern at Beloved Head Industries, I, I will not comment on that. That's that's fine. All right, let's 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 get this, let's get the ball rolling, man. Wasalo's in the building. Um, okay. Super fight predictions. You're not new to this. You're true to this. You know what to do. I'm gonna start your clock. You can start off wherever you want. Okay. Uh, Danny Myers is gonna thirty shotgun shug. Yeah, I don't know why some people say uh, shotgun shug is a gatekeeper. He's more like a revolving door. Every time I turn around, there's a new battler in the URL because he couldn't really get him out of here, like a DNA or a, or a John John. Um. Uh, Went from a gatekeeper to a revolving door. I like where this is going already. Yeah, he's more of like, yeah, like Shotgun Shug is more of like a, a punching bag. I, one thing I kind of noticed is if if the URL wants to start like pushing somebody, they'll give them Shotgun Shug so they look better. Like, okay, let's start pushing B Dot. Let's give him give him Shug. We want to start pushing Jada Nightwing. Let's give him Shug. We want to start pushing Danny Myers more. Let's give him Shug. And then, yeah, just easy wins, and then, yeah, makes them look better. <laughs> um, CC, uh, you have no words. This is not about me, sir. Uh, keep, keep going, Wasalu. Let's see. Uh, Bill Collector versus Big T. Big T. I'm going to say, I'm going to say that one's, that one's a. Two one either way. I think that's gonna be kind of debatable. I think both collectors kind of like had rest, but also Big T has had rest, and he sound sounded pretty good on the tracks. Like maybe this is Ch- Big T's chance to kind of like 
get back into into the URL and get these uh, I don't know bigger checks for Kathy. Um, uh, math. I think I think math is gonna be Gichi two one. I think math has been right has been writing these rounds for uh, for a long time now. I feel like even when he, this match wasn't set up, math was still writing for this, and then Gichi's like, yeah three battles in one month. So I could, I could see Math beating him. That's a, fair, also that's, that's a fair point, actually. That's the best point for Math I've heard ever. And also, I, I kind of see this maybe as being maybe Math's like last chance to kind of like get in the good base of the, of the URL, even though, fortunately for him, he does have other stuff going on of his own, which is really dope. Yeah. Um, Nun Nun versus JC. Oh boy, I, I, I like I like Nun Nun. I'm gonna say two one. I, I, I've seen I've seen moments where JC gives up and comers plates, and yeah, they just they just end up beating him. Uh, <laughs> um, wait, CC. I told you Frozenberg Raw wasn't gonna lose at the Wawa Cup, so I've been right the past two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen. Loso beat JC. None, none beat Loso. So, by that math, yeah, yeah. You know but, but, I, I know that but, math never works. I'm, I'm just, but, I'm kidding, guys. I know that's not how but, battle rap works. I'm just playing. You, you, you see how they get quiet when facts get thrown around, hey, man, Uh oh, hardcore players say how much you want to bet. I wonder if all the like. Battle rappers in Hitman Hollow, Hitman Hollow's room are just like looking down on him. Like, <laughs> <laughs> please take us off of your wall. <laughs> um, my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, my, <laughs> my, uh, my toxic take is that uh, I don't know how Jack Boy Maine is gonna make it to the T-Top battle if he's still at Gnome looking for his chain. <laughs> um, yeah, that's all I got. Uh, uh, if you want uh, any more uh, battle rap humor, follow me at Comedian Wasalu, W-A-S-A-L-U. As usual, I love you guys. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Have a good weekend, guys. Yeah, Take Wasalu, care. Wasalu, man. You're always a hard act to follow, man. We appreciate <laughs> you as always, brother. Take care, man. No. Thank you so much for the platform. I appreciate it. Love, love all of you guys. Take Peace. care, guys. Peace. CC, this guy picked Nun Nun, and then he said all the faces on Hitman Hollow's walls looking down at him after the Cassidy battle. Does it get any more toxic than this? Well, uh, Wasalu, uh, whenever you get back in the chat, I know Hardcore Flavor is going to want you to put some money on that Nun Nun. <laughs> he he, he, he want to bet that. Right, right, right. All right, um, let's bring in Kevin. Kevin's in the waiting room. Let's bring Kevin in. Oh, my goodness, man. That was so funny, bro. He called Sugar Punching Bag. What's up? What's up? What's up, man? All right, Kevin, okay. you hear us? Hold on, hold on. We got to change my name, man. That's my real name. Um, I was about to say Kevin. It's too late yeah, now. Nah, we all seen it. Talk bad, man. How you think this? It's just too late, bro. We've all seen it. Yeah, that was me. That was me. <laughs> That was me going crazy. It's over. It's over. It's, it's, this is on camera. This is on wax. This is live on air with hundreds of people watching. It's over. That's my real name. It's over. <laughs> everybody, everybody know my name. Whatever. It's cool. <laughs> the angles is coming. The angles is coming now. Damn. <laughs> All right, Kevin. The person before you said none of is going to be JC. He said Sugar's a punching bag. And he said that Hitman Hollis' face is on his wall. is looking down at him. I don't know how you're so, gonna top, I don't know how you're gonna top any of that, but I look forward to hearing what you have to say. I'm not gonna lie. First, he had me tight <laughs> with the sugar's a punching bag. The people that think sugar's a punching bag started watching battle rap when caffeine picked it up. Ooh, that's how I feel. That's <laughs> that's a, that's that's one, bro. It was they going crazy. Talking they went heavy. crazy. On Shug. Like people gotta understand. Like Shug battle rock outside. Like that. Yeah. Smack does give Shook to people that he wants to start up. He battled Rock outside. Like, Shook was on the first few URL cards, bro. Like, people be losing their minds to me. I hate when people, like, talk bad about Shook. Like, that shit kills me. Shook is fake a legend. Let's keep his stats. 
because people are giving people legend status of being around. Shook is definitely a vet. He's fake a legend, bro. Like, come on, man. They be doing, they be doing Shook crazy though. I'm not gonna lie, they be doing Shook crazy. Yeah, you got whatever me. though. You got, you got if, me, you got me invested with this energy. I like it already. I'm gonna start your clock, bro. Super fight yes. card. I'm gonna let you pick whatever match you want. Talk your shit is on you. All right, man. First match, what? JC none none. Go for it. <laughs> Listen, man. JC is premium mids. All right. Here's the thing with JC. JC's pen is fire. Let's not get it twisted. JC is one of the best pens in battle rap. But battling JC does nothing for you unless you are a new cat. Or if you're on a decline, like none none. I'm bugging. I see friend's face. He like sun tweaking. Yeah. <laughs> That's a fact, bro. I'm not gonna lie. No big names. Like y'all was saying that JC accepts the smaller names or whatever. Like no, those are the names that gets offered to him. That's why he accepts them. Because these big names don't want to battle JC because it does nothing for them, honestly. That's how I feel. But mm. JC is going to cook not nothing. Like, come on, let's be real. <laughs> <laughs> I say that to say this. I say that to say that JC Let me will cook none you, none. you feel me? How do you slander him then to pick him? Like, I don't get this. Because, you know bro, what? I just, clock. Got, I just clock. keep I have it no real. Questions. It's your clock. It's your clock. Yeah. Sure. No, no, I was just saying, I keep it real, bro. I just got to keep it real, man. <laughs> what's the um? What's the next battle, bro? All right, Bill Collector versus Big T. I'm not going to lie. I don't know if y'all been seeing the face-offs, like DNA had it and all that. Mm-hmm. This shit is going to be hilarious. I'm actually really interested into seeing how Big T is going to flow now being skinny T. You feel me? Little T. I want to see how he going to move being little T. But honestly, I feel like that's going to be one of those battles that's just like whatever. Like, if you like Big T's rounds more, you're going to pick him. If you like Collector more, you're going to pick him. One of those. You feel me? What's next? All right. Okay. Uh, I, I've noticed real quick, everybody's talking yeah. very nicely about that battle. Nobody's talking crazy about that battle. I like it. Yeah, because I feel like the energy in that battle is, is fun. You feel me? It's a fun battle. Like, Bill Collector's a funny guy. Big T's a funny guy. Like, it's going to be fun. I'm at, I'm at work, by the way, y'all. I work in the school. I'm wailing. We, we appreciate that. <laughs> Everybody that pulls up is always at work, and we appreciate you <laughs> risking the paycheck to talk some toxic shit. All right, man? You know the vibes, uh, man. Shotgun Shug versus Danny Myers. You were just defending Shug. <laughs> Better pick him to win. Yo, I'm not going to hold you, though. Danny Myers is the other person for me that that's my guy. <laughs> like, Danny Myers is my guy. But I'm not going to lie. So you better win this one, my guy. You better win this one because you got me up here talking crazy for you, bro. <laughs> you got to win this one. Because I'm not going to lie. I can't front. Like, his his caffeine showings besides the B-Dot one ain't been all that. And who he battled in the um in the little barbershop joint in the little shop? He battled Brooklyn Hands, and that was that was forgettable. Yeah, like like it started good, but like my son Brooklyn Hands took over. Like, so Suge need this one, bro. And it seems like Suge likes to defeat pens. Like you know what I I, I don't Suge always been the type like when he battles a pen, he like that's what he that's the battle he wants to win. B dot Big T or whatever. <sighs> Denny Myers been sitting out last two, three events, man. I don't know. That's going to be a fight right there, man. That's going to be a fight. I got Shook mm-hmm. taking round one. I got Danny taking round three. We all know Shook loses teams. Round two is going to be the one that's going to be the deciding factor. Okay, mm-hmm. fair, fair. Before we ask you the last battle, the chat is saying, are you a hall monitor at your job? Am I a hall monitor? Hey, well, hold on. <laughs> like, I, hold on. Never a hall monitor. I'm actually a para, I'm a paraprofessional. Thank you very much. Per professional, I'm just on my lunch break, you know. All right, yeah. <laughs> talk that shit, man. Talk, talk to the chat. Talk to this chat. Talk to the chat. Listen, I, they lucky chat. I can't see it because I'm in the zoom. But the people that was in the chat, y'all was wilding. They think <laughs> they see it. Listen, man, y'all going crazy. My son Sug is not a punching bag. The last guy that was up here, he looked like Soul Con, and he had me dead. <laughs> he had me dead. Hitman holla. You need to get your wall repainted, big bro. <laughs> it's over for that, my guy. Cassie did my son so dirty. Oh my God, Cassie did my son so dirty. How you lose a how you lose a battle to somebody who's trash? Nigga said, like, friends, like, we're not here to talk about that today, yeah, man. I've talked about it for the last three months. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry. Last battle, last G- battle. Get your math, let's hear it. <laughs> Listen, man. 
I put I got a video up on my channel about this too, man. Math and Geechee, bro. I'm not gonna lie, SoCon didn't know what he was talking about, but he was right about that. Like that might have been the only thing he knew what he was talking about. <laughs> Math, if he doesn't win this battle, just bro, you've been wanting to battle Geechee for the last year and a half, maybe like pre-quarantine, my guy. Pre-quarantine, he's been trying to battle Geechee. Yeah. The, 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 the tricky thing about this is that I think Geechee can defeat Mav. You feel me? Mm -hmm. But it all depends on what Geechee is thinking in his brain. We all know sometimes battle rappers, they go into a battle, they think Sun is trash, they don't prepare well enough, they don't write well enough. I honestly feel like Geechee thinks Mav is trash. Like, I don't think he's trolling when he says that. I think he's dead serious. Like, nah, math is trash. And I think that might come back and bite him. You feel me? Mm. Math, you better at least win one round clearly, though, bro. You I need one clear. One clear. Yeah. He got to get one clear. He got to. He got yeah. to. He needs one clear. He needs that. He need one clear. He needs one clear. But Geechee, you know what Geechee do? And Geechee in that tournament, man, listen. If Jack Boy Main defeats T Top, I won't watch no other battle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that's a bet. <laughs> if Jack now. Boy Main moves on, I will not watch any other battle, man. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yes, yeah, listen, I man. Expecting that. I'm flipping that. I am. Yo, Let's Kev, go man, you were great, man. Hopefully, we get you back Woo. on here next Thursday, man. You, you were awesome. Yeah, man. Like, let, I be talking mad shit to y'all on Twitter and always, shit, but I fuck always, with y'all, bro. Always, you know the man. vibes. We, we appreciate. We appreciate the love, bro. You already, man. Coach is so bad. I'm out of here. Salute. Salute. Well, you know what? Okay, I, ladies. You know I know he, me and he, wait. Time out. I know me, Marla, Tata, and any other ladies in the chat. You know what we was thinking about. I I, I ain't gonna hold you up. Oh, I, I don't even know Marla. half of what he was talking about. I was looking at that beard, Marla. I was looking at that beard and the ways. I ain't oh, gonna hold you up. Where's the horny police? I didn't know what the fuck he was talking about. Oh, brother. <laughs> no, nah, fuck that. No, nah, because no, nah, if we would have had a baddie on here talking some bad rap, the men would have. Well, you are a baddie. What are you talking about? You talk here every day. Well, y'all see me every day, so it it, it it dwindles away, right? But I'm just talking about this like a No, baddie. it doesn't. <laughs> every day Mama, somebody's in this chat you calling you something thing. crazy. That time. What, what, what is happening here, man? Control, control what's in here. No, you know what? Let me and the ladies have our moment. Because, you know, let us have our moment. Shit. Man, you look at him. Got the horny police meme on me right now. <laughs> oh, I lied. Yes, I do. <laughs> look. Nah, it's all good. Have your moment, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Coach Marla. Bev says, Bev says, and that's the mask beard. You didn't even see the combed out beard. Hold on. Now next oh, Thursday, Marla. now next Thursday, he gonna come with the comb beard and a nice he fit. Looking, he gonna be looking fine, fine. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna be looking fine, fine. <laughs> you fine. You not fine. You fine. Okay, we done. Okay, Marla. You know sometimes the girls got to get eye candy too from time to time. Let us get some eye candy. Man, Ms. okay, Marla that's the beer. When we talk about beer, that's what we're talking about. Like, that's a. Mm. Okay, I'm done. Hey, Jolisa, I have nothing to say. Y'all enjoy that. Enjoy it. <laughs> Kev will be back next week, all right? Kev will be back next week. We, we appreciate uh, the love, Kev. No brown. LTBR is a real ESPN of Battle Rap. We Jolisa. appreciate that. All right. Uh. You know, that's how you be crooked your neck, ladies. When you like that one guy, you be like, Ooh. that's the innocent look. You know, them. no one from Detroit is innocent. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just, let me say up, Savage, bring your ass up here. Thank you for the props, coaches. Thank you for the props. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
All right, see, um, I might have to boogie board in a little bit. So who, who's next up, man? So I could I could give you this host. Savage. Savage. I have sent you right. a link. I'm gonna make you a host. And for everybody wondering why I be right. leaving, I, I I got work to do. All right, you know what I'm saying. My 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 job kind of overlaps with LTBR daily, but we make it happen though. All right, I'm gonna make you the host. So you can uh. Hold on, let me bring him in first, actually. Did you say you was ready? No, let's bring him in first, and then I'll make you the host. Oh, okay. My yeah. bad, mister. Okay, I seen that late. There you go. Uh-oh, wait a minute. Don't be trying to pull up looking sexy flexy now. Wait you see, look what you, look what you done started, Cece. Look what you done started, all right? This guy came in here flexing. Oh, hey, I'm at work. <laughs> I'm, I'm about to work right now myself. You know what I'm saying? I got to transition work. over a little bit. You know, welcome to the gun show. But... <laughs> You know, how y'all doing today? You know, I said I, I jump in real quick while my ah, balls. Okay, he got him a nice beard too. You know, with the body. Hey, go ahead, yeah. Savage. Go ahead, ladies. You know, uh, you I, know I, what? I, I'm gonna I'm gonna delay work for five minutes because I really want to hear <laughs> Savage talk his shit. You know, what I'm saying I fuck with yeah. Savage. He shows us mad Thanks. love. You know, what I'm saying he's a dedicated guy to the culture. He's not new to this. He's true to this, and he's very toxic. So I'm gonna start his yeah. clock. You already know yes, the vibes, my brother. Super fight. Yes. Take it over. Okay. First things first. Um, Turbo is going 30 none now. We already got that out of the way. Because when <laughs> wait, 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 what do you, you call him Turbo? <laughs> Chris Stokes Jr., he's going to be out there moonwalking all over none now. I, I, I'm telling you, he's going to get in his bag. Uh, okay. Then, I got, I got, I'm telling you, Turbo's going 30 none now. Okay. Next, I got. I got shotgun shook two one over mid tier Danny. Okay, he's he's packing Danny ass up, sending him back to Cali on the first thing smoking. You see what my man? They're ready in Cali. Well, <laughs> oh that's God. even better. He ain't even, that means he can take a bus home. We don't even need a plane for it. Okay, you see what Shug did with B dot? I got Shug beating mid tier Danny. Neither one of them fools getting lux. Turbo and mid tier Danny. Neither one of them getting lux ever, 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 ever in life. Okay, um, lowercase T. He getting smoked. That's that's hit either. Oh. Okay. And then I got Geechee Gotti 3 0 over the Smoothie King. Geechee's going 30 the Smoothie King. I, I'm betting five smoothies on Geechee. Five <laughs> smoothies on Geechee. I got five smoothies. Whoever wants that work, I will bet on. I got five smoothies. I got, I'm telling you, hold up. I will break out the wallet. I got the old school Gucci wallet just so I could bet all my money. On Gigi. Okay, now all y'all that had high for two, two one, y'all trying to bet? Y'all Look, trying to bet stuff? Okay. Hold up. If you want the Lexus, you can get the Lexus too. Who oh, other oh, one? Oh, 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 flex it. Flex it out here. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I can, you want you want to see me flex? I, I can flex with the guns and the funds. Okay. Oh. I'm CC, right. CC, take it easy over there, see. Oh, CC's hey. losing her mind. CC's losing her mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Hey. If y'all, if y'all saw me, because you know I was down at Max House. I had, I was in VIP. If you saw me, I was in VIP. Okay, I'm telling you, I'm very important. Well, at least my money is. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I flock in, I fly out, just everywhere. You know, I wear this bulletproof vest for nothing. You know, I always want to shoot back at me sometimes. You never know. You never know. But I'm telling you, it's gonna be the night of 30s. Everybody get 30s. You get a 30. You get a 30. You get a 30. That's what it's gonna be. But I'm telling you, whoever want that smoothie smoke, I got it. Gigi Gotti, 3 0 on the smoothie king. I'm telling you. I don't know if that's <laughs> Terry Jones duck big K so he can get 30 by nitty. What the hell was that? Oh, he came, he came in for some more smoke. Keep going. Keep going. Tell us how you really feel about everything. Tell us how I you really feel. About three. You muted yourself. You muted yourself. Unmute yourself. Yo, yeah, yeah. Seriously, he had the right people in his life because if if he had a, he had a good advisor, he would have told him, "Hey, Big Block." You know that's why I like to call Big K. I call him Big Block. I would took Big Block over Nitty. <laughs> <laughs> this was gonna come out and get smoked by Nitty after Duck and T. I said, "Oh my God!" I said, "Shit, we ain't doing that." But yeah, but look, Smoothie King. All them foods, me and Tim, Danny and, and Turbo, they need to form like a tag team, do a two on two together. Okay. 
call them never getting lux. That's be their, their tag team name. Never getting lux. And then they can battle like they can battle like gun titles because both of them already had stood in front of lux. Boom, match up, match up. You need some Jesus. <laughs> Yo, you need <I'm> therapy. <laughs> I, I got that tatted on me hey. already. I got oh, all this stuff. Hey. I got, I got, I got Jesus tats everywhere. I'm telling, I'm telling you. So that's you know. not God like. You know, it's a God <laughs> love. <laughs> you know, that's what they say on the arms. You know, look. You know, I'm five eight, two thirty. I can bench press three sixty five, and I'm fine. You know, what I'm, there you go, like. I'm just saying. How much can you bench press? Three sixty five. That's my. That's what I'm on right now. I'm trying to get the full five by by the end of this summer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you lady. Know, listen, I can do two twenty five. That's the combine weight. I can do that over twenty times. If you go on my IG, you can see it. I, I really be in that gym getting this work in. Uh, I'm telling you, I can lift them up, up over my head. Um, Savage Vandross is wild strong. Wow, wow. opinionated. And Are you funny. military? I was Are you in the military. military? You, you heard it here. He was. He was. There you go. <laughs> Were you a Marine? No, nah, I was an Army. Army? Yeah. Okay, I can tell. Y'all crazy. Y'all right right military men crazy. <laughs> yeah, that bullet hole right there ain't come from the Army. But, you know, I'm out here. I'm out here. <laughs> Oh, yeah. What made you go with that he verse? They be lying about their height. He really five six. <laughs> I ain't no six five six. God damn, they try to hate him. Look right. See the pictures. Listen. If you see me in person, you, you know I'm, I ain't no goddamn midget. Cause I'm way taller than K Shine. I saw him. I saw Shine. Okay. Yeah, that's what. Yeah, that's Shine that's, and JC are the same height. I tell people this all the time. You know, I man, look, look, I'm fine. You know. Yeah, no. I'm like the finest nigga in battle rap. I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't gonna hold you. Follow yeah. me, Savage Man, across on Twitter and YouTube. I'm, I'm proud of that too. Savage Ooh. Man, uh, where can everybody find Thank your YouTube you. before I let you go? That was fun. What's your, what's your YouTube channel before we let you go? Oh. <sighs> Dude, we're, we're, back, we're back to work. <laughs> he got that command. <laughs> Attention. Hey, can you, can you hear me? I said, I... Yo, let the people know where your YouTube before you go. And Savage Vandross. That's it. Everything Savage Vandross. YouTube, Twitter, uh, Instagram, Savage Vandross 81. Yeah, you know. If you want to look at some you know, mid-town complexion dude that look good, you know, drive around in fancy cars and, you know, do nice things, holler at me. Lady. You know, I'd be like your baby mama's favorite person. Uh See, 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 you got you got to cut his clock, man. You got to let him go. He got he to gotta go. I'm just saying. The clock is over. See, see, you're the host. You have to let him go. Y'all have a good one. I'll be back in the chat. Peace, bro. Please. <laughs> oh. Oh. Ladies, we got us some guns. We got us some nice manicure beards. We got us some waves. We got us some nice voices. You know, some of y'all have nice voices. I ain't just, I ain't told y'all yet. But some of y'all got some nice voices. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, th this is a very male dominated culture. Let us have our moments too, fellas. When we see a fine ass man talk that shit, let us sit back and be able to enjoy. You know, clench our pearls, you know, do one of these, you know. Bite the lip. Why not have our moment? I didn't say anything. I gotta go. All right. <laughs> I I gotta run. You know. Maybe, maybe staying for that was a mistake. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See. I gotta go. Okay. Oh. Yo, yo. Mister. Morning, 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 morning. Good morning. Are you at work? No, I'm not at work. I'm okay, actually dropping somebody else. I'm dropping a girl right now. Okay, I see. That's what's up. You drop your All queen right. off. You know what I'm saying? You, you make sure your queen gets wherever she got to go safely. 
Okay, but we doing super oh, yeah, fight prediction. <clears throat> okay, you good? All right. Okay, yeah, so good. first. I just want to say this. I just want to say this. Just because somebody do good, don't make them win. Don't make them the winner. Just because they mean? do good in the battle, don't make them the winner. Like, like okay, like, when people, like, see China Shug versus Vida, right? People were saying that that was a good Shug versus Shug. He went out. I'm like, okay, yeah, that was a good Shug, but did he really win the battle? Like, that, that, that narrative, like, it's because I'm doing good. Like, Cassidy, he did good. Like, he improved. This battle with this with hitman, but still, like his haymakers wasn't like but it was like brushes, but little 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 taps. Like he had good setups, but still was taps. <laughs> right. No, I definitely agree. I think that's definitely something that I'm pretty sure that come Saturday with Danny and Shug, that's going to be another conversation we're going to have to have as far as people giving people battles because they did better than what was expected. But let's talk about another one. We got JC versus None None. How you calling that one? I got, uh, JC 2-1. I think that's going to be a real double battle because None None, like, literally every time he's up, to the plate, he has been, you know what I'm saying, showing like, hey, I'm here. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> don't count me out. Like, like, don't sleep on me. And okay. we all know what he do. He, 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 you know what I'm saying? He one of the top pins, so it's like, that's a nail bite for me. Like, I what both of them do. Like, nothing come up in there, you don't expect him to punch as hard as he do or none of it like you'd be like damn none of where the fuck you been <laughs> right <laughs> okay but let's go to uh, okay let's go to big t and uh bill collector how you calling that one i got big t on that for 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 the, for the uh for the ups like like a, i don't know if it's gonna be an upset if People like when I feel like like now he like okay yeah this is my time I'm ready for this like I hope he once he figure out this caffeine room because this is debut you on caffeine I hope it translates well Bill already been in this position so right. like okay we already know what Bill going 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 how he going wild out. But we see how he's going to wild out. They going to dance. Hey, let's see how how good them steps going to be. Right. So I got that. I got a big T on a slight edge. Slight edge. I think that's going to be a real good battle. I got All right, let's get to the main. That. I believe huh? it's battle of the night. <clears throat> you think which one's going to battle of the night? being battle of the night. Okay. Okay. Let's just get to the uh, main event. Potential two. For sure. Let's get to the main uh, event. Let's got, talk about that. I got Gigi. And... I got Gigi. I got. I got Gigi. I got Gigi. It's like I like Mav do. I like like Stitch Flash. And that was funny. <laughs> I'll bring some more like some of the some some of his comedic. Uh, attribute to this, but also would like to see how he would translate up in this Kathleen room too, because he did pretty decent with Jack and like his last few battles, but it's like we need more from you. Like you, you claiming to be this goat other 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 game, so we need to see that and giving us that goat material. You know, it's like you still having debatables, like with you should have cleared Jag. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I can hear that. It's just <laughs> stuff like that. I can hear that. 
And then I got I, I got Danny. I got Danny. I, I, he got a whole. He got a his, his. You see him like like yesterday? I'm like, oh no, nah, this Danny right here is scary. Like he's serious. Like it, you usually see him smiling. They never. You did not see Danny smile yesterday. <laughs> like Danny okay, is keep that right now. All right, all right. Well, again, thank you, Mister, for pulling up on this Toxic Thursday. Wherever you get, get there safely. Will do, will do. Always, right. always. We need, we need Vlad up here one day, man. One day we got to get Vlad up here. He going to come back. He going to come back <laughs> home one day. See ya. See y'all. Have, have, everybody have a nice one. Let's show you two, man. Okay. I'm going to do, I'm going to try to do one more pull up. Uh, Dice, did you DM me? Where's Dice Mob? Where's Dice Mob? I'm going to try. I'm going to try to pull one more person up. Oh, it says you can't DM me. Oh, uh -huh. well, I'm going to DM you. Well, what's that about? All right, Dice Mob, I just sent you the link. That would probably be the last one for today because it's about to be noon. And I got things to do too, y'all. Y'all know I'm busy. I stay busy. Okay. But shout out to everybody that's been <laughs> tapping in. Oh, if you're watching this on YouTube, definitely go into the comment box and let us know if you agree with anybody. If you're thinking anybody was crazy, tripping, give us your predictions and make sure you just subscribe and like. And also check out uh, Coin Flip and Dylan. Let's talk, let's think bad rap. New video dropped this morning as well comment section whatever <laughs> you know what i mean shoo you here let me see let me see i don't see you guys i sent you the link go to your uh twitter dm and click on the link and then i will uh pull you in shout out to everyone y'all got me laughing for past 40 minutes bro i have been laughing my ass off today um i have been laughing my ass off today y'all this one was fun cc can i slide can I slide in my dm any day savage you better stop because you better stop mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> don't gas them y'all <laughs> but look ladies we want to see some uh, you know what I want to say this so bad. I know. Okay. There's a few of my friends. Oh, here he goes. So I ain't going to say I'm going to save it for another day. <laughs> Dice Mob, what up, though? What's that? Hold on. Let me turn the camera around. Camera, 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 if I know how to do that. All right, I got you. Oh, shit. Okay. You got to like that. Hello? Mm -hmm. Okay, you gotta mute something though. There's an echo. I got the headphones on. You can hear me now, right? Yes, I don't hear no echo. All right, what's happening? Okay, well, you know what we're doing. You the last one to pull up to give super fight predictions. So we're gonna start from the bottom of the card and work our way up. Let's talk about JC and Nun Nun. How are you calling that? Um, I got JC for the win just because he's not finna play with none none, but I I I got none none doing real good. Okay, you got that like two one three zero oh, gentleman thirty. Thirty. You got gentleman thirty. Yeah, no, well, not I, I. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't with the uh, the generous rounds, the giveaway rounds. I feel like JC gonna show levels. But none of going to do real good. I just think JC going to show levels, and I don't think he's going to give up a round. Gentlemen's 30, I just believe that's a nice way of saying you lost. I, I'm going to just say. <laughs> that's what's up. Okay. Everybody's entitled to their opinion, y'all. So we're going to move on to the next one. Bill Collector and Big T. How you feeling about that one? Um, I'm going Big T. I'm going with Big T. I know a lot of people say they ain't been seeing Big T lately. They ain't seen him on the stage. Bill Collector been doing 
pretty good every time you see him show up. But I've been watching Big T as, as well as his uh his 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 diss tracks, his rapping, some of the stuff he's been on. Big T been more focused and formulated. Like he looked like he's focused, and I just think that's gonna be a little bit more. You know, we've been seeing a lot of bills, so you know what bill coming with Big T. I think it hit you with the element of surprise. Okay, so. all right. I feel like everybody's been kind of back and forth on that one. That's going to probably be a debatable. I feel like that's going to be debatable. But uh, let's move on to Shaka Shook and Danny Myers, who's looking good as far as champion of the year talks. How are you feeling about that? This one is always a weird one for me to call because I'm usually the one going against Danny. But the stretch Danny been on, been crazy. Um... But I, I I think shotgun got something to prove too, so I'm going shotgun. Oh, you think yeah, shotgun going. gonna be the one to give Danny his first loss? At least one of them rounds for sure. Okay. Sure, but um, I I, I like I like Shug to win, but I ain't mad if Danny win because Danny been doing damn good. I know you're a Danny fan, but I, I'm using <laughs> slander and Danny. But no been, slander. <laughs> So I, I could fucks with it. <laughs> That's the uh, what up though, Labs. I see you. All right. So we are at the main events. Geechee Gotti versus Math Hoffa. Did you see the face off? Yeah, I watched I I I streamed the face off on my channel a couple times. Um to me, this is not even a uh, debate. I don't know where the debate comes from. This is not even a debate to me, man. I got I got big crip for the 30 piece nugget. Big Ooh! crip. Now, why do you feel um, Matt Hoffa, who is a legend, can't get a round? You're not going to give him a round? I can't tell you the last time I gave Matt Hoffa a round. Wow. That's just, 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 just how I feel about where he's been in terms of battle rap and when I see him. Um, I, I, I don't really count the legends only and stuff like that. More so because I, I like to see them in a the ring against active niggas. That's the ones I'm counting, the active niggas. The ones that's going to give you a run for your money, who know how to scheme, who know how to punch, who know how to angle, who know how to do all that shit. And you may get any one of those combinations throughout the battle. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen math. I haven't seen him in the past couple of years do that actively. But Geechee, we've seen Geechee do this for the past two, three years straight at a high level. I'm not giving math around on that. Well, Math is round if you want it. You feel me? Damn. Damn. You didn't give him a round versus hollow? A couple people in the chat are asking. Um, you want my opinion, really? Yeah, it's your time. I didn't watch that battle. I don't, I, <laughs> you know, have been doing very well to me, bro. I, I ain't even gonna lie to you. Like, hollow, I, I ain't, hollow has to come back and do some crazy shit before I want to see hollow. Um, and math is the same thing. You got to show and prove. Okay. Well, Dice Mob has spoken. He got the last word. And uh, thank you for pulling up. And it was fun, man. But I'm going to let you go on and finish rolling that blunt and enjoying your day. <laughs> I forgot y'all can see what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> yes, we can see everything. <laughs> But I'm going to let you go. You enjoy your day. You too. For sure, for sure. Uh, how can we do this? Uh, hold on one second, y'all. Yes. Okay, y'all. Hold on. Okay. So there you have it. It's about to be noon. That's enough toxicity for one day. Thank everybody for pulling up. Thank you to the new ones that pulled up. You know, I like to see a new couple of people pull up a day, you know, or on the Toxic Thursday. So thank you. Ladies, we know we had our we had our fun. Tata, if you missed it, it will be on YouTube. And when you get to a particular person, you already gonna know the shit. So and yes, we are doing an after party on Saturday. So after Super Fight is over, we will be going live, me, France, and the crew. 
and we're going to talk about it. So until then, definitely make sure y'all be safe out there. We're going to be uploading this episode on YouTube, Spotify, and iTunes. So definitely make sure you are following us. Also, um, what else I was going to say? Oh, let's think that a wrap. New episode. We are giving Arsenal his roses, his flowers, all that good stuff. So definitely check that out. Shout out to Dylan and Coin Flip on another great production as I was on. And until so Saturday, you guys be safe out there. Let's talk batterup.com. Grab you some merch. Four times we'll be looking into your order as well. And until then, I'm going out in fireworks. Yes. Thank you for the props. And thank you for the props, Tata. And I will see y'all later.